I guess we can go down the line. What what led to that um, early start, and and what was the game plan going in that y'all started off so strong? I got it first. Um, our game plan was to be us. We wanted to be the aggressor and be aggressive on both ends of the court. Um, we wanted to make sure that we got stops as well as we pushed in transition. And I think we executed well. I think we looked at our plays and executed great. I think everybody stepped up individually and collectively. And um, that's us. We want to play like that every single game. Um, I would say our energy, our our energy was just contagious. Um, one through five, and we wanted to get defensive stops, and we also wanted to score on offense. So, um, we just wanted to keep pushing and transition. Um, it was a revenge game for us. We wanted to come back, and you know, we didn't handle our business at their house, so we wanted to handle our business here in front of our fans. What do you think was different about this game than the last one, and what did y'all plan for to uh, to take advantage of a revenge game? Um, exactly what Sid said. We wanted to be the aggressor. We wanted to rebound. That was a huge point of emphasis for us. So just um, being aggressive and having energy and just coming out and popping them first. I have four steals. Um, what went into the preparation, and, and were you just feeling good on the defensive side tonight? Um, honestly, I didn't know I had my career high in steals. It's about 30 seconds ago. <laughs> um, but <laughs> um, no, I think it's just consistently working hard um, in practice. I think it's trying to anticipate more. Uh, Coach Nick has really been encouraging us to anticipate passing lanes um, and good on-ball def defense and like not getting too close to drivers and just knowing personnel. And I think we played the scout well. And I mean, my team definitely helped me with that when they were in gaps helping me out. And um, they were putting pressure on the ball so I could run through passing lanes. So I credit to my team. Um, I just wanted to be aggressive, you know, um, crash the boards and just, you know, look for my shot when I'm open and look for my teammates when I wasn't open. So I just felt like everything was in the flow and everybody was, like the energy was contagious and I just, it was easy. It was fun. This question for, for all of y'all, or all three of y'all. Um, obviously, I think it was like 23 of 35 shots were assisted. You know, so how, many, how big was just that ball movement and being able to find each other in those um, situations? I mean, that's fun basketball. I mean, we're sharing the ball, we're passing the ball, we're winging the ball around, and um, we're making the right reads. I mean, that's fun. I mean, the energy was there, the crowd was there. Um, I think if we can play like that and get that many assists every single game, like, we're going to be in great shape. Yeah, I would just say, um, I think on, on display, our drawing and kicking was way much better tonight, and we found the open player, and everybody can knock down shots on our team, so it was just exciting to see that. Um, it was a huge like point of emphasis for us to make the right reads. So I felt like we all knew where each other was going to be. We we did it in practice, and we practiced it. We just needed to put it on display in the game, and we, we did that tonight. Lex, you've talked about just wanting to be that leader coming in. How much do you feel like you've kind of taken another step in that direction tonight? Um, I just want my teammates to be able to rely on me as a leader, as a player, as a person, you know? And so I feel like just being able to step up in games and being able to be relied on is a huge thing for me.